Welcome to the section. What we what we do, y'all? Inclusively ball and inclusively fall. You know? <laughs> I got a list. I'm saying it. I said 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 it.
just dating, you know what I'm saying, a little bit more casually and not so exclusively. Like, uh, like I don't know, I feel like just certain bonds couldn't have, it, it wouldn't have been so tarnished. That's mm -hmm. like, I'm in a space in my life now where I don't want to... I don't want to break up and we like hating each other. Like, mm -hmm. yeah. And I grew up like that's what kind of the stuff that I grew up on. Like my parents, like they never spoke to each other like that. Mm -hmm. Like and when they did, it was always like turmoil and chaos <laughs> and shit. Like I don't want to grow up like that. Like I don't I want. I don't want that for my kids. I don't want that just for me and the, like just the relationships that I'm going to see in the future. Like I don't want to do all that fussing, arguing. Again, it takes two. So you have to also, I can't sit up here and say it's all on the other person too. Exactly. Like, just mm -hmm. learning myself right now. So just definitely like somebody that's going to understand like, or just wants to also learn me as yeah. much as I want to learn them. Mm -hmm. for that I totally time. agree with that. And not pressure me into getting into whatever. Like, just you, gotta love you, your, you gotta love yourself before you can love somebody else. People don't really know that. Like, if I hate, 100%. Like, you can't be fucked up, like, emotionally and, mm -hmm. and then... And I was there, you feel me? Like, I've been there. Like, like, that's crazy. Like, how you going to have you fucked up? Then I'm a person, I'm not saying our person might be fucked up, but it's like, you can't love somebody if you don't love yourself. Right, because Real hurt shit. people hurt people. And that's so if you're truth. damaged and you're hurting, you're going to only inflict that onto mm -hmm. me. You know what I mean? So, yeah. mm -mm. Especially, like, when you're going through, like, so, like when you're not at where you want to be, you know, in Absolutely. life and stuff, or you, you're lacking certain things that you want from the world, or you feel mm -hmm. like you, this thing's not working out for you, or you get on Instagram all the time and see everything that everybody else says. Mm -hmm. And that's another thing, like, I was watching one uh, another podcast one day, I forget which exact one it was, but they were talking about, like, what do you feel like has like played a big role in spoiling certain things about relationships mm. and then everybody was saying like social media social, social media, media. Mm -hmm. i agree because even thinking about like the amount of people we for lack of a better phrase run through mm -hmm. like if it wasn't social media half the people we have talked to over the years we Real probably would have never met them never and we yeah. probably would have been able to experience a different kind of love that's more whole mm -hmm. versus like mm -hmm. you cute on instagram and you dm me and you just so happen to say the right that. thing think about how many people that probably dm you and say the wrong thing just because it's social media, but if they saw you in person, they might have had a better effect on you. Mm -hmm. And you could probably could have found love sooner. Like, we just, we run through so many people that I think people are getting, like, mute, like, um, immune to the experience we, of meeting somebody yeah. and liking yeah. somebody. Yeah, and like, they giving you butterflies. And they making you that. feel you good. You know what I'm saying? Like, that type of date. And, like, let's take it back to the 90s. Like, we so digital. Yeah. yeah. Like, yeah. it's crazy for that. Everybody even say, like, what did Instagram look like? Like, yeah, why the fuck does it matter? They, and like that's something you go to, and mm -hmm. it's, it's that's you, true. You gonna judge somebody off what they Instagram that's look true. like, and that goes both ways. It like does. my nigga now, like. I was like, well, him get Instagram like that. I, I want to. Mm -hmm. It goes like, a lot. It's just like, like damn. Well, it's it's kind of right. I mean, but like, like for good reasons though. Yeah. Like everything mm -hmm. has a reason. It might not be the be the like the original reason, like you feel, but it's a reason. It's like, an edge or takes away. Yeah, yeah, like it does in today's yeah. world anyway. Because I feel like it's I hate such a the attention seekers. I hate the. It's such a factor. It like, is a factor. It's crazy that it's really a factor. It really is. Even like I think <laughs> social media, because in my experience, somebody I used to date would like he was kind of awkward in person. Mm. But on social media, he's like Mr. Superstar. Like, and it's yeah. like, and I remember being like, why, why the fuck can't you show up in person? Yeah. Mm -hmm. But we'll be mute all day and can be on Instagram like all day. And it's like, that's, that made me sad. Like, mm -hmm. I want somebody that, that can show up in, in real life. Yeah. People don't have social <laughs> skills no more. People don't know how to like socially interact with others. And it's crazy because mm -hmm. it's like, like, having a conversation really is a big thing now. Like, it was also a problem with, like, a relationship that I've been in. It's yeah. like a few situations. Like, get off your phone, y'all. Yo. People like, cannot yeah, have conversations anymore, y'all. Like, we can, like, we don't even gotta be, like, mm -hmm. late looking into, into each other's eyes and shit. Like, right, but, like... You have to be like... Like, like, what, am I, like what am I around you for? Why are you, like... You know why you need to be because we hear you. You like we just on yes. our phones like mm -hmm. for hours upon hours, and don't get me wrong, like 
I don't mind being in silence. Like sometimes yeah, I, I like silent like company. Music, sometimes. You, I love it. I love it. I don't know what it is. Like, I don't love it, but I always let me not say I, I wouldn't say I love <laughs> it, but dope. I can definitely <laughs> accept somebody that like understands when I don't want to talk right now, mm -hmm. and it's not that I'm. You know, man, I, I mean, yeah, I'm just like, I just don't want to so let's be quiet. Yeah. Like, yeah, let's just peaceful. sit here and enjoy each other's yeah. company. Yeah. Let's just talking. Like, exactly. Yeah. Like, you can talk, you can say a little, hey, what you, you hungry? <laughs> yeah. But yeah, yeah. Hungry. that's why I'm so big on intimacy. Like, you don't have to talk, we don't have, it's just like, mm -hmm. be there, and I would love that. You I know need what intimacy. I mean? That's I like my number that. one. You like cuddles. I love, I love cuddles. cuddles. Like, there are no verbal service. service. Yes. Like, yes. I'm so Since good. Sense of touch. Sense of service. Oh, yes. I'm I'm service. You, you slide for me, I'm sliding on the wall like, oh, shit. <laughs> I love it. Because once I had this, Real I used talk, to. like, that is so good. Yeah, that's important. Like, one guy, we used to um, date or whatever, and we would go to the store, but one day, he brought me what the fuck I wanted from the store without me even having to tell him. I'm like, yes. oh, my God. Like, yes. it'd be small shit. Even if somebody shit. sent me, like, $10. Like, anything. Oh, my God. Yes. Like that. Wow. Like, that yeah. means so yeah. think about me. Yeah. I'm always trying to me. make sure like everybody is straight is good, all the right? time. Like, and if I can't make sure somebody's straight, I feel like I'm not showing up. Mm, right. Like, As y'all know, I'm in a long distance relationship. So his ex is like super duper important because he's not physically here. Mm -hmm. So literally the other week, I was having such a good day, like good ass day. <laughs> Then I go home and he had flowers like sitting at my door like I wanted to cry because it was like I didn't have to ask. I didn't yeah. have to say nothing. Just did it. Yeah. Just did it. Like service, that means yeah. everything to me. Ask for service. Mm -hmm. That's the best feeling when you don't gotta ask somebody to do something, you just do it. Yes. You oh my god. So let me ask about like girls though. Like do girls deliver acts of service? Let me ask something. Cause I I had a, a guy that I was dealing with. He told me that like asked me like why don't we give you guys flowers? Like literal flowers like is that a I thing i can't say that for everybody it's not flowers but i, but I think it's just the message flowers. to flowers <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what i'm not saying i want you to bring me no flowers. i want to okay. that you know what i'm saying like uh, i think it's just I'm the idea straight. i think guys want to be celebrated okay just celebrate it pretty yeah like i would say i will like, say like i'm even learning ways like to do it like in what ways right like when i was here i would like get him like surprise gifts Mm -hmm. Or do you like a movie night and get like the like, movie even so white simple popcorn as thing like and stuff like that? Like, damn, you bought me new drawers? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Like, that's the but I'm trying to think of other ways besides gifts of feeling like, you know, I am showing some like, type of extra. Mm, okay, he like, like that. that. <laughs> he like that. <laughs> I don't know. I just I feel like that's a big act to serve. I feel like that. Like, damn, man, you like that. I'm hungry. You like that. I'm like, I order some food. Coming that motherfucker. You like, yeah, it's food, right? I can imagine that. Even as a kid, like, like walking home from being outside all day, your mother cooked. You be like, I cry. Yo. Like, how you know I was hungry? <laughs> I'm not like the like, like. I don't want to order food all the time. Yeah, like, I want to cook. But I ain't gonna lie, like. It's when you get a female who really do shit for you. I like the kinds of their heart, and they just do that shit. It feel good because, excuse my language, bitches are stingy. Like, I ain't gonna stingy, lie. Yo. Bitches are stingy, and then when stingy, you, then yo. when they say they stingy, it's the like truth. they got a, they got a reason to be stingy. It's like, and I, I and I understand it because like I was a stingy. I was never. about to say I felt like I was stingy at one point, but it was because I was taking advantage of. Yeah, and yeah. see, that's what I was gonna say. Like some people, some girls I know are just genuinely giving or whatever, and then mm. and somebody to take you to a point. Exactly. So, you know what I'm saying? Literally. But the man, like, I don't know. But I feel like I the right person friends. will pull it out of you, yeah. too, though. Like, and that's, and so the that's right person will pull it out of you. Yeah. But, how you, but it's, that's the thing. That's some, what another thing right I want to speak though? on. Because it's like, you could have the right person in your face and you wouldn't even know because it's like a lot of things people don't understand. Like, when you want to deal with somebody, compromise is probably like top three things. Mm -hmm. If you don't know how to compromise, like, like we said on the friendship. We said it before, just just friendships and relationships. If you don't know how to compromise with the person you want to be with, your shit is fucked. And then also understand and knowing your person enough to know the stuff that you're not willing to compromise. Oh, yeah, yeah. Before you get so totally... And communicating crazy. it. Mm -hmm. Communicating I'm not cool shit. with that. Because That's in the top three, too. Communication. Yeah. Communication, compromise. It'd be hard if I had another C word, but I ain't think of it. <laughs> but yeah, yo, dope. like real shit, like it's like... People block their blessings literally because it's like, like you can be dealing with a person. Y'all ever like dealt with somebody like, all right, we dealt with each other in high school. 
but it was some little kid shit. Like, I ain't, I ain't. Yeah. Gonna, and then y'all, y'all meet again. Y'all like 22, 20. You're like, damn. Mm-hmm. You've been like this the whole time. The whole time I was childish. Mm-hmm. You feel what I'm saying? Like, it's like, it, it took us so long because it's like, we didn't know compromise. <laughs> I'm just saying, like, nah, I'm just, it, it happens. But so that like, has yeah. happened to me on the flip side. Like, I was on the other side of the story where people have come to me like, yeah, like, I like I didn't know what I had. And I'm yeah, not trying to, like, I ain't they trying to They told you that? Yeah, I've been told Man, that. Fuck out of here. Don't tell me that. Like, let me, let, <laughs> let me figure that out. Don't tell me that. That's no, but th- no, that, no, that's how, I just feel like, that's, a, and just going back to G's point about having, still having some type of positivity outside of your relationship. Mm-hmm. I feel like I enjoy it because I'm I don't think I'm a closure person, but I like to just wash my hands with shit sometimes. Mm-hmm. And look, if they feel comfortable enough to open up and tell me that they felt like something that they missed out, then I'm cool with it. So have you ever felt like you missed out? No. Never. Never. Mm. Never. Never. And I'ma say I, I don't know if this is why how you feel, but I don't mm-hmm. be feeling like I missed out because when I'm with you, I'm giving my all. That's and why I, I feel, feel like, like that's exactly why I feel like I don't feel like I But how do you out. know your all is is what they need? Like not like this is what I'm saying. It's like a lot of times with coming from a guy, a mm-hmm. lot of times with females, y'all think y'all know shit and y'all don't get to know shit. Like, I feel like at you know, you get to a certain age, well, I mean, I can speak for me and probably they as well. Mm-hmm. Like, we get to the point where we communicate. We we read the room. We but give I don't you. Think no girl is ever just gonna sit up here and say like, yeah, I feel like I fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Let me really think about this. Let me think. It's like it's like it's why it's like y'all minds be made up. Yeah, like y'all minds be made up. It's like okay, like it'd be like all right, like every girl, I'm a good one. We all y'all can't be good. It it's some it, it, it's some horrible bitches out here. Excuse my language again. I'm pretty mature. Yeah. I feel like I know my strengths and my weaknesses. Yeah. Like I know where I'm faulty at. So another thing is like you know your body. Mm-hmm. And a lot of people, a lot <laughs> of people, mean, she know her body. <laughs> she knows know she is. Really. She know her likes. Okay. She know her dislikes. She not raised. She's she's she you knows what she wants. So she's I'm not ready to settle for some shit. Because I spend so much time by myself. Like, so what the girls that they in tune with these songs? Where they at? Where they be at? I, I sprinkle these songs. <laughs> it's hard to find them because it's like... I agree. It's just hard. Like, well, I, think, I think we do... I don't want to say lack, but mess up in certain areas. Absolutely. I will say that. I, I will admit that. that. But y'all keep that shit to yourselves and stuff. No, I'm not going to admit that shit. That's not, well, I don't know the bitches y'all be, but I, the bitches, I don't, we, no, I can't no, hate no, 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 I can say when I fuck up. Do like, y'all say it right then and there, or do y'all need time to cool off? It took me a long time. To exactly. Do that's the point. Time. That's the I point. Ain't gonna lie, that's I don't. the point. If, if if it's really that big, y'all can y'all y'all announce it right then and there. It's not no. Like y'all know how. Y'all y'all, y'all think cause y'all had time to cool off. Let that be a nigga. We don't have time to yeah, cool off. We gotta make our mind up. That's what it, hey. Either you gonna fuck around and fuck around, or you gonna get right. Okay. You know what I'm saying? But y'all gotta cool off. That's fucked up. Okay. I think that's crazy. Let me not talk you for a week. Why I can't come back at I don't think I have a situation that applies to that though. That's good. Okay. <laughs> don't watch yourself for that. Don't try to be that shit is good. That's, That's good. excellent. Okay. That's because that shit is mind breaking because it's like everybody thinks they know each other when you don't and because don't. the pride That's is in so the way. And they don't mm-hmm. be willing to give, you know. Like, mm. No, I, I like think it's everything is on their dime type Everything. Because we the prize. Wow. Yeah, I got it. But, okay, but, but, not, but, I don't, but I don't drag it though. Like, right, don't drag it. I'm never going to take advantage of it. I'm going to make that shit known. I ain't even want to sit here and lie to y'all. Like, I'm going to make that shit known. Like, that's just that. So, but, so can I ask you, can, can, can the guy be a prize? No. That's not how the world works. Wow, so I won't it say. It work like that. The world doesn't work <laughs> like that. <laughs> Why? Niggas chase. I ain't gonna lie, I'm always no, like that. say I'm hurt. So how I'm are hurt. you the prize if you the chaser? Who's chasing? Niggas chase. chase. You don't know who that, chase that's me. me. That's male nature. Male nature is I gotta have to this. Hunt. I gotta have this. I gotta have this. That's understandable, yes. But at the same token, it's like... Always, though. Always? It's always. Like, we always... But when we get y'all, we treat y'all good. No. Y'all do. <laughs> y'all do. That's <laughs> a thing. No. <laughs> I, all right, this is why this is why my relationship works so well. Yeah, I'm not ready. I'm not. I put my foot down. Not saying I run my shit because I don't. It's an equal. It's an equal partnership. 
But you're not ready to sit here and say anything. If I feel some type of way, I'ma say it. And I and I'm that type, oh, you hang up on me, oh you we not talking to you, call me back. You know y'all be like, uh, oh, hey, so I call you back. Exactly. I don't play that shit. I'm not playing that shit, bro. That's how you got to do I mean, that's way. I used to be, oh, I hang up there, you gotta call me back. But I'm not like that no more. No. Oh, I don't know when I'm gonna grow up like y'all. Because it's like yo, that's what I'm saying. You gotta stop that shit. Like, I ain't gonna sit on here and fuck. Am I gonna play? Don't blow my shit up. Got that shit in compliance, okay? Yeah. Cause he will literally be like, all right, you want bullshit? Or oh, I'm gonna let you hear your bullshit. Not saying yeah. it's okay. I will say that like sometimes I'd be like, all right, I feel like a better words, you acting like a bitch. A bitch. Yeah. <laughs> and I you just say a real fake. Yeah, but then sometimes I still be on it. I'm not even gonna sit and lie to the ones who still be on it like me. We'll get it together one day. <laughs> I try not to be. I really try not to be. So let me ask y'all this. Do you feel as though like a, a sprinkle of toxic is needed sometimes? Oh, I'm trying to get out of that. You don't know. Like, but you, like, I, mean, I mean, I'm mean, like, damn, I don't got no tea for the girls. Like, we like, could. But I feel like why? that's the problem. I read somewhere that we kind of thrive off of that. Which is so, weird. Which is so weird. weird. Because it's like, like damn. We crave toxic. We crave it. Sometimes, like, what? Even down to like situations that's not good for us. Mm -hmm. so I got confession. Like, go ahead, confess. I be starting arguments. Oh, we know you ain't got to confess that niggas, no. Be like, oh, because like, it it's so peaceful to the point where some days I be like, I'm doing Like, this shit too, this shit <laughs> yeah. too crazy. Yeah. Like, what the fuck is we doing right? And I ain't going to lie. Up, and we don't argue a lot. Like, I'm not used to that. Like, my right. parents' situation, we argue every fucking yeah, day. Yeah, I don't like arguing. Mm -hmm. Now it's like, like he's so laid back and chill. It's like that's different, good, right? So now my argument be like, oh, well, I just feel like you don't care because you ain't saying that. Yeah, because we'll argue. It's like, do you really care? You know, like it's horrible. It's a horrible mindset. It's but bad. that's the reality of like, we don't argue. Or you ain't like that. Saying that to me. Do you Listen, care? just because you acknowledge that shit don't make it good. No, it's good. <laughs> <laughs> it's good to that. acknowledge it, right? But it's, it, it, it's like... That's like a drug addict saying, hey, I, I do drugs. And I'm going to keep doing them motherfuckers. Like, what do you mean? Mm -hmm. I'm just being real well, with y'all. That's what the drug addict But that's the thing. And that's, what I, and that's what me and you saying. You can acknowledge something all day, but if you don't work on that shit, that means nothing. Mm -hmm. Nothing. That's true. that's true. Nothing like, oh, like, yeah, I know I'm a crazy bitch. <laughs> what you going to do about it? Like, what, <laughs> what are some things you that... You want to keep being crazy? What are some things that make a bad relationship? I'm going to start. Well, that men need to work on. I, 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 I ain't going to go in, but I'm going to start. I, I'm I have never ahead. really been in a bad relationship because, like, I've never been in a lot. Like, my girl I'm with now, I can say this is really my first real, real relationship. Oh. How long have you been together? Nine years now. That's so sad. That's so sad. We for real. We yeah. know each other. Pretty much, yeah. 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 But it's like, it's like, I had to become a better man mm -hmm. to become that shit because it's like, I, I don't say I was immature. I had, I, I had my way. Like mm -hmm. it, but it's like you gotta realize, like yo, you you don't got nobody to really that know you. And what are some things that men need to work on? What are some things you feel okay. like you paid to work men on? Men need to men need to know. Stop lying. Stop listen. Stop fucking lying. Thank you. Girl, if bye. you if you really who you are, we talking about the men. We talking tell about straight up. Tell them straight up. <laughs> we talking about the men. Tell them straight up. Just stop lying. Mm -hmm. Y'all stop lying too. Y'all lie too. But we talked about that stuff already about the men. But the men, like, like I said, when you want to deal with her, stop <laughs> lying. <laughs> we don't have a stand on there. I'm crying. If she's not the only female you talk to, though. Yeah, don't, don't sugarcoat yeah, it. Yeah, a lot of times, like, guys who want to forsake. A woman, you know what I'm saying? Like, take. I don't like for somebody to take it, um, take advantage of my, um, like my discretion. You know what I'm saying? Like my my right of judgment. Right. That's what I mean. Because like, you won't give me the full story. Yeah, like that's not fair to me. And oftentimes, like that's what guys will do instead of just saying like. I'm not just fucking you. Like, yeah, yeah they just simple as that. They're gonna fuck you away. Like, it's yeah. real. Like, they really want to. Like, that's just how it works. The but. foundation of a good, the relationship is friendship. Like, I'm not gonna lie. Bro, me and my girl was friends for two years. Me and my girl was friends for two years. Two years. I'm talking about friends. I'm not talking about, I'm not talking about we fucking, I was not fucking my girl. None of that. Like, none of that. We wasn't doing none of that. We was friends. Mm. Strictly friends. We talked every day on the phone. We were friends. Like, that's how you people that. make it complicated. Yeah. They make it complicated. Yeah. Complicated. Like, even if I say I talk to a female, 
she would know because it's like I don't want you to be blindsided about anything exactly. because it's like I don't want that to start off no shit like we cool and I'm gonna respect you as such I'm not gonna disrespect you even that's another thing niggas is disrespectful so disrespectful so it's like yo if you if you know if you know all right say you tell a girl you deal with a girl right okay you didn't told her don't bring the girls around each other because that's just a that's a mutual respect thing from both parties why would you do that so that's just how I feel about like sometimes like guys need to do better in certain areas when they when they doing stuff like that. Mm -hmm. You feel me? But. I feel like guys also just like the friends conversation has to develop a form of honesty with themselves. Mm -hmm. Like if you know you're not in a place to give a girl what she wants, let that just shit rock. Like just, just do it with your just thing, go, bro. Yeah, you like, know when you right. that's how you do your thing too, bro. Like yeah. that's what I mean. like I'm a big that's believer in fate and like. that things that's supposed to be gonna be. So like. It, it might not be right now. It might yeah, not be sure, ever, but yeah. like, let's just do what's right. Like, it's no point. It's no, no point. Let it rock. Just let it rock. Like, you only cause more damage to the more situation. Damage. To now, now, you, now she won't hate you. And then yeah, you, you yeah. in her yeah. pocket. Why are you talking to that nigga? That's, that's my man. Oh, another thing, fellas. Just because a nigga, you talk, that's not your man's. So, <laughs> leave these girls alone. Like, if they talking to a nigga, y'all y'all just went to fourth grade, that's not your man. Get your situation it like right that. first. Yeah. Yeah. When you try doing all that, get your, get your thoughts right and your situation right. Like, I always recommend everybody in the book think and grow rich. Um, because it just talks literally about growing rich. Like, it speaks on how so many men, like, they reach success at 40. Like, 40 and beyond is that point. Why though? Because they spend so much time, like, chasing pussy. Mm -hmm. Like, just running into women and you know what I'm saying? Like that's your main goal, your main focus. And that don't mean to shut yourself off completely. But it's just like prioritize. Yeah, mm -hmm. literally. Like, it, like we, we the only species that declare sex is like open season. Like mm -hmm. every species has a mating season. Mm -hmm. so, yeah, like, that's true. We the only ones that do our thing all the time with, whenever we feel like it, even when it's in the, we not in the best situation. Mm -hmm. Like, cause it might make me feel it good. good. Like, it's so <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Like we don't we, we kinda lose judgment sometimes when it comes to that for real. So let me ask y'all this. What are you guys' views on submission? Like how do you feel about that? Like why how, like for I'm you guys? I'm being submissive. Okay. I like to be submissive to my woman. Like, but I don't want I don't want you walking all over me. That's what I don't want. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't I don't want you to, cause I'm a I'm a sweet I'm genuine I'm like I'm just genuinely a sweet guy. Mm -hmm. But at the same token though, I don't like being taken too far. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And that can kind of like that's triggering to me. Okay. For you to yeah. Think that you won't get over. Mm -hmm. Yeah, cause I want to be able to be submissive. Like I want to be able to feel like, alright, you got this. You the man. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. But it's hard to do that. I feel like, I, and I'm the same as they, I I honestly prefer to be in submission. Like, I want to be submissive to my man, but men have to make us feel, like, comfortable yeah, enough the or, to the point that's, that's that I, I can feel comfortable doing it. Like... But see, that's what that's the trouble. That's the troublesome part because, granted, yeah, I do like to be submissive, but I still want my woman to know that she's a woman. Sex matters in a relationship. Fuck yes! Fuck yeah! Fuck yeah! I just yeah. go out quiet now, because I'm not going to lie. That. Something that I did realize though, like, if you try to be in a relationship, I don't, I mean, just me for me, like, I don't. <laughs> you know, I don't I'm wondering, like, should you really fuck on the first night to find out? I mean, I feel as though if you want to, don't be ashamed of it. Yeah, but I feel yeah, like... But at the same point in time, like, do you feel like you starting to bond too early, though? Like, off of sex? It depends on the people. It depends on that culture. Because I know women who are like... Can... <laughs> it depends on the fucking people, y'all. I know women who are that like, too, I'll take that. Like, like, I want... I, like, I, I know women that can look at sex as just sex. And that's true for me. I, like, I cannot. <laughs> and see, I, I, it's like... 
I'm a guy like it's 50 50 with me. Like, don't get me wrong. Like, I can fuck with somebody. Like, I can fuck somebody and don't look at it as nothing. Or we mm-hmm. just fucking for real. But there have been them times where you like, no, you my best. How long do you feel like you gotta have sex when you in a relationship anyway? So, and that was the thing, like, my last situation for real, like, I wanted to do it all the time, but that's what I was used to, though. Know? Like, that's what I was used to. And I, that don't mean I gotta do it, like, at every second, but, like, a couple times a week. Like, yes, I, I, don't wanna skip, yeah. I don't want to skip, I don't want to skip a week. Like, now, if we do skip a week, don't get me wrong. Like, if we work in, like, we got shit going on, like, we can't always do it, but... I'm gonna fuck. Yeah. Like, <laughs> like, I'm just sorry. I am. I agree. I'm like the most. I'm sorry. What you ain't saying? I'm sorry. My my drive is high, so I don't know. Like, 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 like she was slow because yeah. like she was still good, but like she just couldn't understand like why you like you are like am, am I only here that's for that? Yeah. Like, it wasn't that. But that's why you gotta have somebody with your same chemistry, mm-hmm. like. And that's the thing too. But that's what I'm saying about. Do you have to learn that person because we you know, also I feel as though you do. We fucked early on, mm-hmm. so Excuse it's me. like. I would have said no if you asked me a few years ago, but now I say yeah. Like, I feel like with my boyfriend now, like, we definitely had to learn each other. So like, you all for, like, dating, for, like, for, well, you're the girl, so I'm not listening to you. <laughs> so, like, so, like, so, like, but no, like, all right, so, but, yet, like, even as the girl, like, all right, you, you, you are suggesting a, a nice young lady to me or whatever. Okay. Do you feel like... We wrong for fucking on the first night. Not if y'all have the chemistry. Like if it's like. But if, what is the chemistry though? I feel like, like when you know, you know, like you kind of just really into this person. You it's can, a vibe. You, yeah, it's you a vibe. Mm-hmm. Interested in you interested in the weirdest shit, most random shit about them. Like you want to know more about them. like you really interested. And a lot of times, if they flirt in the way you want to be flirted with, and they hitting all the right notes, then go for it. It's some people who have fucked on the first night who have been married 10 plus years. Yes. So it depends on the people to me yeah, I think personally. Yeah, it depends really on the happen. people. Like, yeah. See, I'm just trying to live in the moment right now. I yeah, don't you, know. You, like, right you, now, I'm just trying to live in the moment. Like, I just, I be you can't, you can't yeah. think. That's what I'm saying. Like, my last situation kind of triggered me because it was something that was like, uh, mm. we not supposed to be getting this serious, but we end up getting this serious. I was dating and I like oh, like straight told him like yo I don't want a relationship and it was you get what I'm saying the time was horrible it was like bad holidays timing. rolling around I'm at this nigga house every like and it just got to a point where like <laughs> look I'm gonna be here every day so he gonna be with me like that's how it is that's though how like that's how that's how it's supposed to be you can't force shit. And like it's like a lot of and a lot of people problem nowadays they put the time limit on too much shit. And see, I got <clears> that's <throat> what I had to get out of for real. Like just stuff, I'm like I said, living in the moment for real. Mm-hmm. Like, and I and, and I'm proud of myself for that too. Show. You know what? We dated for a whole year before we did got to that point. Because I really was serious, like, no, I'm always up under somebody. I want to be able to you date. Need time mm-hmm. for yourself. Speaking of, that's so important to you. Take time to yourself, like we were talking about earlier. You really have to learn yourself first before you sure go does. into, you know, dealing with somebody else, becoming a, a, a you know, a, a unit. A unit, you know what I mean? Like, I agree. That's important. Because I feel like the, the timing with me and my boyfriend was right on, was right on because mm-hmm. literally my life was, it like fell apart crazy and it like came together. Like, literally, I got a boyfriend, a new job, a new house in the same month. Yeah. You- and yeah. it was just like, this is crazy, but it was just kind of like, I looked at it as God rewarded me because I did spend that time and those hours figuring out who I am, what I like, what I don't like, what I want to do for my career, what kind of person I want to be, what kind of daughter I want to be. Like, I thought about those things mm-hmm. when I was on my self yeah, right. so yeah. And then when I said, yeah, this is who I want to be, even if 
it might change next year, but right now, this is what I want. And, and that's the problem. Exactly. To right. so make sure you're whole before you go into something like that because relationships, they are so serious. They so are so. Serious. so Everything is you so never serious. know what you're doing. It's not now. It's like you literally, like, we so possessive. Yeah, yeah. Awesome. and I had to let that go too. Mm-hmm. You can't. Like you're mine, you're mine. Like even Lauren Lund, I think she said it. Like you're mine. You have to learn how to enjoy some something or somebody because it's for that moment. You. you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Nobody belongs to you. You yeah, know what I mean? Sure just does. enjoy them and and let that just be what it is. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So how? Like all right. Let's know back when we was like younger. It used to be like. Will you be my girlfriend? <laughs> but like my girl, I didn't like really ask my girl. You didn't like, ask her? No. I don't like that. No, nah, but it's like, <laughs> all right, the point, like like you said, you the, point, the point of my life where I was at was I need my girl for a long time. Like, you feel me? And it's like, we went to school together too. Mm-hmm. We went to uh, B Triple C. We started going to mm-hmm. B Triple C level. Like, I've been newer. Yeah. Like, you feel what I'm saying? So it was more so like, I'm carrying up books sometimes. Like, mm-hmm. we already talk every day. Yeah, that's you feel what I'm saying? Like, it's like, yeah, I know her mother. She knew my mother. Mm-hmm. I know some of her family. She know my family. So it's like, why not be my girlfriend? It only made sense, right? Like, I don't know. Just, just, just the words, when you be my girlfriend, just corny and shit. That's mm-hmm. corny. I'm just mm-hmm. sorry. It's just like, that shit ain't for everybody. All right. Yeah, I feel how you feel for real. Yeah, that, you be my So how do you ask to be with somebody? How do you solidify it's not, it? It's more so of an understanding, not a time. I don't like that understanding shit. Like that. I don't like you that gotta understand. tell me. If you, me, right, like, if you ask me, like, yo, like, we, we doing this. You're not dealing with nobody. I'm not dealing with nobody. We need to still have this. It's not, will you be my girl? No, we're going to have that conversation. Like, okay, we've been doing this for this amount of time. Where do we go? I'm not I asking, feel as though we. That like, situation, man. I'm asking. You need to. You got to ask. I'm not asking. Shit getting worse, you got to ask. Wait, you my like, you get what I'm saying? Like, oh, you, and you and on my side, shit. I've been manipulated. Mm-hmm. You know, I thought it was this, and he like, no, it isn't this, and then turn around, like, and see, and then I'm I've been because horribly manipulated. I don't, I don't want you to think, like, it's not like that, but it's not like that, but I don't want to lose you. And my you thing so is, pick what the fuck you like. Like, like fuck with me or not. That's that, and that that's goes back to, like you said, like, standing. But you got to have the right chemistry. Like, I feel like, again, when you know, you know, like, you just know. You want you to be that see person that. all day long, like. You know you like me. Yeah. <laughs> but you gotta see, and you got to see people in all their forms. Like, a Absolutely. lot of people get caught up. A lot of people get caught up in, like, the fucking physical. The physical, like, mm-hmm. bro, some people out here are bad. You bad. You know, you got your shit together. Job, car, got money. You look good. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So but sweet. your mind, it's your mind up. is it's nasty. Up. That's why, you, like how you said, it's so important to take your time because everybody don't show. It's like a, a wolf in sheep's clothing. Everybody doesn't yeah. show those sides of themselves. Why would you? So know? Sing. Exactly. Yeah. So that's why you can't just take your part. time. I'm trying to get you. Mm-hmm. God for real because, like, I don't know. Like, I, I, I don't want to sound petty, but I can't be. Like, I don't want to just... I don't want to be fucking with just birds. But like, why, <laughs> why, not say, why, not, why not be picky? Why not? You, you, you the prize, bro. Mm-hmm. You can be picky. We at the age. Yeah. We can be picky. Oh, right? Remember that. Oh, you are the prize. You are the prize. I'm the prize. We are the prize. We right here. We we right here right now because we prize. Y'all niggas is for everybody. Y'all ain't no fucking prize. Don't believe that hype. <laughs> I don't know where the fuck girls be looking for these niggas, but I ain't gonna lie, like a lot of females, they be like, I hate, but you messing with the same type of niggas and you know you are. Mm-hmm. I don't like, like I'm not you the keep fucking with girls, what, like, what, like, what, what qualities do y'all like in the people that y'all? My quality, like what you, that you dealing with? Yeah. Okay, so, what one do you thing, like? open mind. Because okay. I wasn't open mind at first, and I got into that. Because I was, like I said, we talked about I was a close minded kid. Sure, sure, sure. So it's like my girl opened my mind to a lot of shit going out of town. I didn't like airplanes. I swear to God. <laughs> I didn't get that on the airplane until I was 23, bro. Mm. I was scared. Like, it's just like open mind, you know, attitudes. No, like fussing. Like, can y'all talk without fussing? Like, can we have a... Like, can we have a... Can we communicate? If you're yeah. yelling at me, I'm going to shut down. Yeah. And I used to like that. I used to think that shit was cute. I hate it. It's I don't not. like that shit. I did too. I used to have a nice piece. I don't like that shit. shit. I, I hate that, that shit. shit. Like, like why are you so stuff. mean? Yeah, yeah. it's probably a lot of stuff. That shit not cool. Oh, and then and then your social... I don't like stuff, you know. You can be around my friends. 
Cause I, I'm the type of person. I'm not Definitely leaving you out. Social. I don't want to leave you out. Like Definitely. I don't want to be like, oh shit, I'm bringing my girl. We, I love that. Out. Let me say something. We that's out. important to you, niggas who leaving your bitches oh at home. That's not okay. Like, I ain't gonna be leaving my girl with a girl. Hold on, I got a question for Dame on that. Your nigga be leaving your girl. Then I say, then I say, wait, no comment. No comment, but leave a comment. No comment, but leave a comment. I don't want to have to leave my girl at the house all the time and then I got to hear about that shit. Yeah, like, you want to hear about it. Like, yo, I want to bring my girl out like shit. But you got to be a girl that's not. That can get you out. You can't force it. Can't. I like my man to be, you know, sweaty, of course. Oh, you know, yes. got to be like chill, um, about his business. Very, very sweet to me, like mm -hmm. so sweet. Um, and I just like somebody I can depend on. Like mm -hmm. I can come to you about it. just anything. I would go to even my friends about or um, just literally anything, work stuff, yes. uh, financial stuff. That's important. And I'm not like a city girl type of girl, but. If I need some money, my nails done. I want my nails paid for. Sure like you know, sure just small yeah, stuff. Sure up, yeah. Um, a generous man, like generous with his time, with his feelings, mm -hmm. and just you know, willing to be open with me. I think those are the things that I I love about money. <laughs> <Speak up>. Okay, for <laughs> me, communication, being able to communicate how you feel or, or what you want that, out of me, or that's said, so I mean, important to me. Yeah. Also being like, I know it's hard for most guys, but being like emotionally available, at least in some type of way, because I know it's hard. Yeah, some type sometimes. of way. Um, sometimes you just got to. You, you have to be because make it seem like you fucking care. Please, like, that's to, all. Like, um. It's just the list could go on and on. I'll be here for days, but you know, just just those are my main two. But communication is the biggest freaking one. What's your favorite position in the bedroom? Oh my god, y'all don't think I'm an old lady. I don't think I'm an old lady. I love it. I love it. I love What's your favorite dish? I got like a duel. Okay. I like um, I like. Give them back shots, but I also like the girls don't like to ride like that. Yeah, but it's like that's like my that's my like can you do it? No. <laughs> <laughs> like, Trey, <laughs> what you <laughs> yeah. I mean, like, like you said, like like I'm in a whole relationship, yo. So it's like everything is sentimental. I like that. It's like, it's like, like, fucking and sex are different. Yeah. No, yeah. Right, you can fuck, but you can have sex. But you basically so, say missionary. That's, that's what you're trying to say. It's not my favorite, but I'm just saying, like. It's okay. That's what we love. It's not missionary. Is it not going to do, like, spontaneous? Yeah, absolutely. Like, like, absolutely. Like, in the car, we on our way to the movies, mom and dad style. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, but I want to. Oh, you should, girl. I had a layover in Fort Lauderdale and we met. Perfect time. Yes, we did it. It, it was love awesome. That's so fun to me. Awesome. Like, we on a break from work. And it was crazy because he was like, what, like, what just happened? Like, did we even say hello? <laughs> so much for tuning in make sure y'all subscribe and follow us on ig the yes. section you know podcast period Episode four of the podcast, y'all. We're excuse the ball and the <laughs> <laughs> I'm, 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 I'